All right, guys, I want to do a video today on sunglasses. Um, I've never dipped a pair. Actually, I did dip a pair with uh, small carbon fiber. They were little Oakley flak jackets, and there was not, not much to see. These are a little bit br wider. Um, cast can? Gas cans. These are gas cans. Um, inside the lens here, if you look real close, you can see a little wire right there. I put that wire in there to keep the groove from getting filled up with base and clear. See that on both of them? Let's see if I get this camera right there. There you go. And on the back of it, these are cabinet door painting tools, actually. Let me show you these. These just squeeze together like this. They're spring-loaded. So I grab a lot of different things with this stuff. You can spread them open wide to the size of your glasses. Um, they just go in the grooves inside there. You can use the, the nose holes or whatever. But they seem to work good for me. Also, the end of it right there I can hang this after it's done in the tank on a one inch PVC pipe and it'll sit right there without touching anything. So that's just what I found that makes life a little simpler. All right, we're going to readjust the camera, drop this uh, rattlesnake skin in here and see what we come up with. Again, I'm not sure about the technique. I'm just going to go in real slow. Um, just go straight in pretty much and I'm gonna get some sort of a seam up on the top edge hopefully on the back edge of this and right across the top here That's what I'm thinking might be the best looking for a single dip with the frames on them or the uh, arms on them anyway uh, hang tight let me adjust this camera
around slowly for you. You can see there's really not much of a seam on the top up there. Let me turn it this way. Don't really see it. Got pretty good coverage with the K2. And there you go. This is Dave with Tsunami Hydrographics. Sunglass dip. I'm going to call it successful so far. Hope you guys liked it.